Yo! Video games. The one thing that's big for, for me personally is that this is a Zelda game with really big dungeons. Like, every dungeon is like at least the fucking size of the Spirit Temple. I didn't find any of the dungeons in this game particularly difficult. Like, I don't remember being like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Like, type of thing. I, but I definitely solved them way quicker than Ocarina of Time's dungeons. Which seem to have a lot of backtracking. Yeah. These monkeys are just always in a fucking bind. Fucking cheeky monkeys! Oh, this is fantastic. Yep. Yeah, this is why we play Nintendo games. For stuff like this. It's like I'm not boss. Good boss. Good boss. Good. <laughs> Link's angry, he just runs and flails. Yeah, this is one of the few Zelda games that lets you do that. That's true, actually. The, every single Zelda game is kind of you just like locked in place, hacking away. Even the 2D ones. Yeah. That's a pretty big change in gameplay, to be honest. And then you have the uh, the greatest change in gameplay, which was one-to-one -one sword action in Skyward Sword, making yeah. you look like a complete tool the entire time. <laughs> My ass one-to-one. -one. Uh, every time I saw Link swinging his sword in Skyward Sword, like, when I saw somebody playing the demo at E3, I'm like, that looks jank as fuck. He's dang! Dang! His fucking sword is going everywhere. I was like, I don't know. Could you actually play it without that? What? Without, like, the one-to-one... -one... No. Really? You couldn't just have X to swipe? They, no. They put so much out, like, made so many things from, like, relying on the motion controls. Fuck. Oh. He's like, whatever. Like, everything. Flying the bird was motion controls. Swimming was motion controls. Rolling the bombs. Throwing the bombs was motion controls. That sucks. Yeah, it, it wasn't good. Well, the thing was, the thing that's okay. The thing that was really bullshit about Skyrim's sort of motion controls is that the whole thing of oh, it's got one to one. It, it, it's total horse crap. Yeah. Because the game technically only re it registers swipe still. So Skyward Sword registers horizontal, left and right. Yeah. You know, if you do that, it, re uh, it registers up and down. Horizontal, yeah, Soul Calibur style. It re and it registers stabs like that. So as you can see, I'm doing all of that right now. Yeah. So why would you put it into make see, people vertical, wiggle their Horizontal, fucking... vertical, and then stabs. The only thing it added was diagonals. You know. Is, okay, so there's there points in the game where diagonals are super critical? Well, yeah, you, you, you have to like hit a boss or way in a, in a diagonal way, but it's like you really could have you could have made diagonals as something, you know. Cause this is mapped to like horizontal, forward, vertical, and then lock forward for stab. You could have done something to make a diagonal swipe in this just as easily. Like it just doesn't. It, it's how it registers hits. You know what that reminds me of. You remember uh, the Star Wars arcade trilogy? Yeah. When you're when you're fucking Luke and you gotta fight Vader and you have like the lightsaber one to one thing. Yeah, with the it's, it's like that. It kind of reminds me of that. That's yeah, basically how it is. And it's it doesn't feel it's, good it's, on that game. It's not the fa It's not one to one because. One to one would mean you could like you could hit someone in any given direction. Yeah. Like I could stab in the upper right corner of the screen and he would stab upward like that, but he doesn't stab up. It's just generic stab or a slash this slash that. Yeah. Yeah, I mean yes, it has diagonals, but you didn't need a whole Wii Motion Plus to do diagonals. Yeah, you didn't have to buy a whole friggin' peripheral just for that. I never got the Wii Motion Plus. Man. Like with my Wii, U, I never had a reason to buy it. I was just like, I don't, I don't need to. It, unless it makes me shooting zombies better in House of the Dead, yeah. which I don't think it does. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! You trying to throw it down there? Yeah. So you know it gets buck faced again. Can you like level up this monkey or some shit? Oh shit, you can't kick. Fuck. Level up the monkey to do damage. Throw the monkey? How about I throw the monkey? Now? Yes! Yes! Now you're thinking! Now you're using that Zelda thought process. Oh fuck! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Fucking wow. It could not have gone any worse. The monkey's like, holy shit, Link, that was pretty bad. 
That was pretty bad. Like, I've seen getting fucked before, but wow. Link's like covered in goo and she's like, no, shut the fuck up, you goddamn cheeky monkey. You know what we should totally fucking play? <clears throat> Hype as balls like on game. We should bust out the Wiimotes and play some Gunblade in New York and La Machine Guns. Who knows about La Machine Guns? I'm not gonna correct it. I, it's, it's not LA Machine Guns. It is indeed La Machine Guns. And Nye Gunblade. Nye Gunblade and La Machine Guns. I gotta, I gotta buy a physical copy of that game. I need that game. Oh, the La Machine Guns thing? Yeah, like the, the two Dude, pack. I don't even know what happened to mine. I got sent it for review by Sega. I don't even know where the fuck it is anymore. Did you give it a 10 out of 10? They might have taken it back. I don't think I gave it. I don't think I gave it a 10 out of 10. 9 out of 10? Don't a light I don't, 11 out I don't of 10? remember. It's probably on Metacritic still somewhere. <laughs> It's really good, man. Fuck! You got blown the fuck up again. Ah, whatever. Whatever is killing makes me stronger. Yeah, this is where I want to be. Deadly creatures, isn't that where you play as a tarantula? Yeah. Or a scorpion. It's actually a really good game. I heard. I heard it wasn't bad. Yeah, Kitasu, some of my some of the arcades around here still have La Machine Guns. Um, the one in Santa Monica has La Machine Guns. Gunblade New York is pretty hard to find uh, in, in working condition. But I remember the I remember the day I went to the arcade and first saw something special. It's a compass! No, it's a smoky. I remember the first day I went to an arcade and saw Gunblade New York, and I was like I was playing games like House of the Dead and Virtual Cop because I love light gun shooters by Sega. The game blew my mind. Like it was, it was the action of like, because you're in a, you're in a helicopter. You're in like you're like a dynamic helicopter that swoops in between the city and shit, and you have your giant vibrating machine gun blasting the fuck out of robots. I'm like, this game is fucking amazing. Oh my god. Yeah, but the arcade without the, that giant like gun. The, size the effect is, is kind of yeah, yeah. Without like a humongous like. Plasma rifle the size of a midget that like vibrates like crazy. It's it misses it's, some of its effects. A, a lot of, a lot of the effect is sort of lost. I do agree, um, but it's still a very fun game, and at least you guys will get to see what we're talking about. Holy oh, fuck! <laughs> I didn't mean to roll all the way off. Goddamn. Uh, you, you you escaped at the perfect time. Actually, that was an amazing spider dodge. Jesus, just understand how to use stairs. They are evolving. <laughs> fuck off. Whap. Can you burn the spider at some point? I would love to know. Holy shit! Fuck, Do it again! Gonna... Do it again! Do it again! Oh! Yeah. Fuck that one up. Yeah! Go, when, you get, when you get to finish it again, jump, jump, climb up there and try it. Ah, fuck. He's already, He's already dead. That'd have been epic as balls if you leapt off the cliff and stabbed it in the face. I would have been pretty chance. Just like, ah, ja! <laughs> dies. <laughs> you almost killed me, but I'm not afraid of you. Let's go. <laughs> Jesus, you got, a, you got a royal herd of monkeys following you now. Uh, Them in their clappy butts. Maybe so, but still. <laughs> I don't like these tiles. Pull that shit out if we can. Look at Link plotting something. Alright, monkeys. <laughs> Face the camera again. Oh shit! The monkeys got all wet. Look at this. Alright, guys. Right, guys. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna find that big baboon. We're gonna fuck him right in his big purple ass. Let's go! <laughs> you run away. <laughs> Three, two, one, hut! Monkey one, you take the left one. Monkey two, you take the right one. Get the right cheek. Ball lick fighter, go! Together we'll make Voltron. 
Pokemon. That would be pretty awesome if Link collected five monkeys, one for the head, one for the arms and legs. Yeah. And he made Voltron Monkey Link. <laughs> I'll farm the head! Bananas and sex too, the sexiting. <laughs> well, I'm glad you guys are willing to put yourself into complete danger and peril. Thank you. It'd be great if as soon as Link jumped on one, it fell. Ah! 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 Wah! <laughs> it just fell down the pit. Huh. Alright guys, you hang out there. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna stab a monkey in the ass. Ugh. Slightly more retarded. <laughs> oh, the giant dick monkey! I'm sorry, the giant ass monkey. He's an ass man. He's a monkey. It's in every fiber of his being. Have you seen the family of asses? Sonic a bird! I'm really glad he doesn't pick his butt. I'm really glad he just slaps it. I just realized he didn't have like a splash screen in like, the title. Fuck you, monkey. Do you have to whip its ass now? Oh my god, yes! Beat, beat that ass! I'm gonna beat your ass! Jesus! Jesus! Oh my god, monkey, stop running! Oh, his own thing smacks it, okay. Beat the ass! Did he do a jumping sword stab into ass? I'd like to see that. Jesus. Rick Moranis. Ah! Yeah, girl! Yeah, do, do, do like the harsh stab. Like, like, get right behind him. Just right up his... Please, I'm, I'm making a request. Right behind him and just do the, do the stab. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh. oh, there we go! <laughs> yeah! The penetrator one. Just <laughs> eight, 18 inches deep, just... Uh, <laughs> and then you're twisting the blade. Ah! <laughs> Suck it, monkey! Oh, was he a good guy the whole time because of the face hugger? Yeah. Oh, he was a good monkey. <laughs> the fuck? Why does my ass hurt so much? I really don't like it that the butt has like wiggle physics. It's got like dead or alive Man, one it's a, physics. It's a, dude, just look up baboon ass. I, I know what a baboon's ass looks like. <laughs> Yay! You got the thing from Smash Brothers. <laughs> Did we get Link any new crazy stuff in uh in Smash Brothers 4? Is he just literally Twilight Princess Link again? I mean, I don't know. Mm, they, I guess they just haven't shown enough of him. I realize that I've probably seen the same shit you have. <laughs> There's not much more media out there, which is really fucking sad that we had to wait that long to get that. There's, there's a screenshot a day. Yeah, but... A lot sometimes it's info, too. Yeah, that's true. But I still, we still like, for, as an example, we still have no idea if Link is an identical carbon copy to his Smash Brothers Brawl version, you know? Because it's still Twilight Princess Link, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's funny because some people still argue that it's, oh, it's not, it's Sky Sword Link. I'm like, dude. It looks just like Twilight Princess to me. Um, he has, well, he has this arm guard on. Yeah, he only has the arm guard in Twilight Princess. And he's not wearing giant poofy pants. <laughs> giant poofy pants. MC Hammer reference pants? Yeah. Ah! 
And first... He looks even girlier in Skyward Sword. Oh, you're right. No, you're totally right. It's funny. He looks more girly, and Zelda looks more like a dude. Ha! Huh. And they, and, they, and they fly a giant Pokemon in the sky. <laughs> in that game. Giant Pokemon. It's like a giant red, like, weird Pokemon-looking bird. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. This. Skyloft birds or whatever. 